Welcome back to Wallatopia. We appreciate you being here as always. And remember, Wallatopia is where you go when you want to know anything and everything there is about the world of wallets. Now today, Rose Anvil is what we're gonna, who we're gonna talk about. And Rose Anvil is owned and lovingly operated by Weston K and Philip, who created a great selection of wallets and other leather gear. They, they've been doing that for a long time. Weston also has a very successful YouTube channel where he's known for deconstructing leather products and especially boots and shoes. So go check him out. Now the Claude wallet is one of their most popular and has been requested by many in our community. So let's get into it. We have a cotton bag here stamped with their logo on the front. Very nice. Open this up and what do we have? Nice thank you card. A couple of them looks like. Ah, I see. Warranty, lifetime warranty. Talks about the sturdiness of hand stitching and what it can provide you. In fact, this is made from Horween leather, which it is and fan is fantastic. Now this particular wallet was launched on Kickstarter. Well, kind of like 90% of all wallets are and the Claude quickly became a success and one of their most favorite uh, wallets that they sell. Interesting. two pieces of leather, this piece, and then one piece that folds around here where it's all been sewn. Very simple in nature, this is the tan color. Stop moving it around so you can get a nice look at it. Quite like this. On to the feature review of the Claude Rose Anvil wallet. This particular wallet only has two slots to it. If we turn it over here, we can see the main. This is a quick access card slot here. You can uh, have your cards in here, cash fold it twice. And um, one thing that's interesting to note is how the weight of the leather, the cut of it is thinner on this front piece than this rear piece on purpose. Now, if we look, of course, the second slot, it's right here in the middle. And this is where you put additional cards as well. Less frequently used, obviously, but uh, a perfect card slot there. And it is a folded piece of leather, one folded piece that comes around and then it has a single piece of leather attached to it on the front. Awesome. And that's a quick review of the features of the Claude wallet from Rose Anvil. Now into the card and cash insertion test. Minimalist carry on this, I think is two cards. Five is reasonable. Company recommends up to eight cards, plus cash folded twice, like we saw here. Um, from a quality perspective, this is designed and made in the United States. Logan, Utah to be specific, it's very close to where I live. I love it up there. It's beautiful in the fall, especially in the fall in particular. Uh, all of Rose Anvil's designs have a quarter circle right here that you can see cut from their, the, the leather. It's uh, kind of a, oh, uh, a mark of their particular brand and it always know always can tell you that it's a rose anvil product now it is a full grain veg tan horween leather it's available in four colors this is saddle stitch it's worth noting the attention to the stitching transition between the pieces this is kind of cool you would think by looking at this that this is just a zip and zip and sewn and done but there's a little more work to it and we do know this is a uh, hand sewn so down here in the bottom where the leather comes together sandwiched it starts it takes uh, from this bottom leather attached to this top leather piece and then it transitions to where the leather is folded here so now you have the leather going through the folded piece underneath and then transitioning back again there same thing goes over here to where you've got a transition component from single leather to, to uh, sandwich leather this is not as easy as it looks to put together but that's just part of the great uh, attention to detail that's put in here by Rose Anvil Perfect weight of leather in my mind at three or four ounces with the edges uh, being ever so slightly burnished right right here, just nicely, just almost kissed with a little bit of burnishing here. 
to give it just a nice little sheen, but uh, nothing fantastic, not uh, anything overdone by painting or something. It's just, it's very natural, but still an attention to detail. Priced at $45, this really reminds me a lot of the Form Function Form Tri-Slot wallet. Very minimal at its core. This, it doesn't get any more simple than the wallet we see right here from them. And the, the quick access to the card in the front, like this, if you just throw this in here, and this comes from this half moon design that's uh, really part of their brand and all their products. Again, you can you know push it up from the bottom, you can pull it from the top, that's probably the easiest thing to do. And it just uh, it gives you quick access, but it holds your cards and your cash in there just fine. Again, minimalism at its best. The measurements on it are 3.75 by 2.5 by 0.3. And it weighs, want to take a guess? Yeah, 11 grams, very, very light. What you'd expect from such a small footprint. Now, Rose Anvil does more than just wallets. It's kind of an eclectic combination of camera harnesses, belts, even heirloom rings that they make. But regardless of what they create, their attention to quality and function is very important to the company's reputation and what they do. Great, great organization. So now let's get into the final score. For quality of five, price of three, features of three, usability of four, and perception of four. That gives us a final score of 40 out of 50. Thanks for joining us. Want to subscribe? Make me happy. Smash that uh, subscribe button. Hit a like on this video. We appreciate you being here. We'll see you in the next review. Bye.